You can save a lot of time as you create documents by browsing the Google Docs template gallery before you start on a project. To do that, you have a couple of options. You can type in a search term up here and say search templates, or if you just want to do a little browsing, click on browse template gallery. These are templates which other users have created and shared, and some of them are very, very good and very, very useful. So you can see a whole bunch of categories here on the left side, and they have some specifically for students and teachers that you might find useful. You can see the list there. So if you're creating a calendar, don't create it from scratch. Um, use the template. When you uh, want to use one, you just click on that, and it will automatically move it over into your Google Documents files. Here's a preview that you can look at before you uh, download it and start to use it. One uh, form or template that I have uh, used and found useful is a Scantron template. Um, if you're a veteran teacher, you've probably used Scantrons at least a, a few times. And this is a digital Scantron. It's a self-grading form. And it's, uh, it's pretty neat. I've used it a couple times. It does take a little bit of advanced uh, formulas in order to use it. But it does work, and it does grade uh, questions, uh, multiple choice questions for you. So that's one you might want to check out. So this is the Google Docs template gallery.